hello guys welcome back to my youtube channel i hope you're doing amazing so i am here to respond to those people that have been asking about how to fix a 2.1 week money queen had and um the feedback that i got from my 2.1 meters video i'm going to link it in the description is that it was not so clear okay and I'm doing a voiceover, by the way, because the audio quality came out really bad. And I want you to really get my point, okay? So, even if I'll be missing on some prepositions, I hope that uh, my explanation will be quite clear. So, this is how the money queen stand comes, okay? And sometimes, most times, uh, the center part... Uh, uh, or the tall part, the tall part does not come fixed, but you just need to put it uh, to fix it to the legs so th such that it can form a tripod. Okay, I'll be showing you the, uh, how to adjust the tripod later. And then there are these three parts that confuse people a lot. This is the ball cock. I am holding it uh, on the right on my right hand, and then there's the knob, the part that you can see as a whole. Yeah, and then there's that other part that I don't know how to call. Okay, so these these three parts are the ones that cause most confusion. So what you do is is that you start with the part that I'm holding. I I don't know the name to that part. Okay, so it has two sides. There's one side with uh, threads, and then there's another side without threads. Okay, so the side without threads that's the side that goes into your stand first do you understand okay you, you, you see the threads let me show you closely okay the threads like a male socket it, it, it looks like a male uh, socket or you can call it a male socket okay so this side the side with the threads does not go straight to the stand the opposite side goes straight to the side because if you look at this uh, knob the knob has a female uh, socket or threads on the inside. So these parts are to join together. The male so socket side and the female socket side are to join together. That means that uh, clearly the side without threads for that uh, part will go straight to the mannequin stand. Okay. And now you're remaining with these two parts, the ball cock and the knob. Okay, so most people get so confused about how to fit the ball. Okay, so how you fit it is just like that. Okay, just you see, you, you do not use the top, you just use the bottom of the, the open knob. Yeah, to fix your ball cock. Okay, so the main um, use of this part of the two parts is that the knob will help you to adjust your mannequin head. So, if you want um, a very stable, a very steady mannequin head, then you will use the knob. You'll turn the knob uh, so hard or to the very end such that it's so strong, you know? And and your mannequin head will not move. If you want your mannequin head to move, maybe you're combing, your maybe blow drying or... Uh, plating or you know uh, flat ironing your wig and you want it to uh, tilt then you'll open up your knob and twist you know your ball cock you, you'll be able to tilt now the ball cock if that makes sense I know it makes sense uh, to some to people that are used to but to beginners I hope it really makes sense okay so that's that's how you fix those three parts. I want to be able to show you like uh when the stand is uh, upright, but I really hope you you can see how you can clearly fix. So there there were those three parts. The first part you 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 fix to the stand. Uh, the other part the other parts you fix um the ball cock and the knob. Okay, okay, and so the ball cock now. The straight part of the ball cock just comes straight to the mannequin head hole, just like that. I know th this is um. There should not be much explanation to this video, honestly. Uh, instead, it it's it's a visual video. That's how we can call it. 
but that's how you just fix your mannequin head i just want to show you how to adjust uh so you can see you can adjust the legs the tripod yeah we can call them the legs using this knob there is a knob that you'll see just um uh, above your tripod or just uh, there and then you open it up if you want uh, your legs to flatten on the tripod to flatten if you want it to be more straight you close the legs and then uh, turn your knob so that it can get fixed uh, the thing with this mannequin stands or any other you know camera stands etc etc is that you have to utilize these knobs if you want to make your mannequin longer you open the center knob and pull you know it's taller than me it's 2.1 meters you know so if you're tall if you are a tall person like me and you want uh, that flexibility you know you do not want to keep on bending or maybe you want to get to the tips of your wig yeah and you want to straighten them really well then you can use uh, the center knob to adjust the height just as you've seen in the video I know it's uh, quite visual, quite clear, but I do not want to assume so that everyone that asked questions about uh, this stand can really uh, get the hang of it, okay? So, yeah, and remember, if you maybe adjust the height, you have to close the knob so that the mannequin head can be steady. So, maybe if you're adjusting your height or um, the legs, the tripod, but you do not uh, turn the knob back then you're not going to experience that stability of your mannequin head and you know the more stable the mannequin head the more the better the results so this is the part i was showing you about okay if you want your mannequin head to be a bit flexible you know to turn to adjust to turn uh if you want to get those back parts uh back parts sorry if you want to get to the sides you just open that knob the knob that we looked at um before you just open it and you know get that flexibility yeah uh i guess that's it i guess that's it those are the parts just use your knobs properly use the ball cock properly and use all the knobs properly the more you use the stand the more you adjust it to your liking okay if you want to purchase such a stand as i have said it has served me for more than four years for sure and with no fault with no rust with nothing with no complaints at all if you want it check the description box i'll leave a link to uh, an amazon link to the stand yeah and that's it guys that's it as you can see my stand is there waiting for my wigs and as you can see it is full of dyes but anyway it works okay Subscribe and bye.